I want to create uh, a tool that has a flat surface here, um, but a fairly sh sturdy but sharp edge along here. And you can see that it's, um, it's still quite narrow. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to take some flakes off this way. And what that'll do is that will create that nice, sharp, straight edge that's, that's really sturdy so that when you're, when you're hide scraping, um, it, you can, you're not going to just break the tool. Um, and this is uh, unifacial technology, which is basically the same thing. But again, it's just flaking off the one surface versus the two. I don't want to put any flakes have any flakes to be on this surface, all the flakes I'm going to take off are going to come off of here. And again, instead of pushing in, I'm, I'm following the surface, this surface here, so I'm actually going to push down this direction versus this way here. And I'm not actually going to try and drive flakes all the way along. I actually want to keep the flakes fairly short and keep them right in here, creating a nice, clean, um, straight, sturdy edge right there. It allows you to clean the edge and make it as straight and sharp as possible. Um, and so what I've done, and here I'll just give it a little, little grind to get rid of the spurs. And what I've done is I've created a nice, straight, sharp edge that is fairly, it's not as acute as on a biface, right? I've actually got an edge that's, it's, uh, and it's really good, and it's nice and sturdy, and you can see that just by rubbing this edge on here, scraping down this, this hide, um, and the nice thing is because there's no flakes on here, when it runs back and forth, it's nice and smooth. So only, the only thing that's cutting is actually this edge. So that allows you the, the control you need to actually prepare, prepare this hide.